Hey yo, what's good? It's your boy Lock Spiegel, and once again I'm back. And uh, I accidentally started another hero quest off screen. I didn't know that this would lead to that. But here we are, you know, doing a hero quest. Um, we're supposed to be going back to Colony Nine, I think. I think it's like Colony Nine or so. So we about to head back to Colony Nine. See what's going on. Help out the masses and help out the old friends and see what's crack lagging. Cause last episode I uh I got on our boy Lens Medic and I don't know who the defender class is gonna go to. It might end up going to um it might end up going to Noah. Or it might go to Lands again. I don't know. This is one or the other. I feel like it's gonna go to Noah. Most likely it's gonna end up going to Noah. Um but yeah. We back. I've been enjoying playing the support role a lot more than I should have. Just to get it off my screen. Sure, I did, Santa. You look great. But basically, I've been playing the support role because I realized how vital. Well, I've been knew how vital the role was in general. But it's way more vital to actively, in my opinion, it's way more vital to actively be playing the support role rather than letting the support role do stuff alone i don't know why i had a brain fart right there like i just i just could not get it out i'm so sorry um but yeah like to me personally i feel like playing the support role especially when you're playing this game on hard mode um i feel like you need to actually use the supports rather than letting them just do their own thing Because it's been times where I've like I've tried to let the supports do their own thing, and they were just too slow. They were they were just literally just too slow with the heals. They would heal people that didn't need to be healed, so like they wouldn't be close to like certain people. So I'm like I would at least like to play one of the supports just to you know balance it out. So if I see like somebody got low health or something, I can just I'm run impressed. to it. You didn't run away this time. I mean, I was never going to run away. Uh, I'll explain what comes next. The rest of you are dismissed. Stay cool, Kite. I'm always cool. Tell us about Agnes's movements. Right now, they're assembling their forces on Everblight Plain. They've stopped okay. concealing themselves, which feels like cause for concern enough. Okay. They're confident they have the numbers for a full assault, then? Or perhaps it's a feint. Or they're just a bunch of dolts who like pretending they have a plan. <laughs> I don't... I'm not in the mood for jokes right now. Yeah, obviously. Hey, we need a little levity sometimes. With enough food, we can draw this out. Give the word and we can even launch a raid. I told you, that's not going to happen. It would cost us too many lives. What then? Our troops are hungry anxious and quite frankly more pissed off by the hour you leave things like this and we're going to fall apart by ourselves we could just remove their reason for fighting you what in plain language please if we smashed your flame clock it would alter the equation if you smashed it uh what well now i know you're all jokers kite biggest joker of all this is why Kite always runner-up in life. No one can take serious with hopeless second-best attitude. Dang. God damn, Rico. God damn, Rico. Shut it, Riku. You, you really know how to hit a man when he's down, yeah, don't you? God damn. 
Ryu came in with the the Ooh. 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 Ryu came in with the what? facts, That's god damn. Anyhow, how'd you worm your way back into Zeon's favor? Meh. No worming performed. We don't need you here. I've had enough of seeing my friends die. Betray me. I can't deal with this dirt anymore. We feel just the same. Which is why we want to do as much as we possibly can to help. That's why we came back. Yeah. You're not fooling anybody. You need not believe them. But they will prove to be an asset. Huh. So that's it. You're siding with them in the end. You choose Noah over your own lieutenant. Again. That's not what I'm saying. Don't you realize how hard I'm trying here? Ugh! Spark this! And he about to get himself killed, bro. Sorry. I didn't mean to complicate matters. On the contrary. Was this not your intent? I would have thought you'd be gloating by now. We can gloat if it makes you feel better. But you can't just judge someone in the heat of the moment. Whatever you might think, suspicion will be cast upon you. That is all I can say. Suspicious or not, isn't it about time you tell us this plan of yours? You said we'd prove to be an asset. I'll continue. Though we have a geographical advantage, our provisions and numbers are limited. That's what the enemy will be banking on. And okay. that's where you come in. As the vanguard. Our sudden appearance will put a spanner in their works, and that'll give you the edge you need, right? Seeing Keves and Agnes Bods fighting together and tearing up their front lines gonna throw them off their game for sure. So we've got to fight independently, then. Better than being on a leash, I suppose. You seem to misunderstand. I'm not cutting you loose. You are still being regarded as traitors. Keep in mind that I shall be supervising your every action personally. Sir, yes, sir, Commander, sir. Do you have to? Let it go, guys. I'll send details of the operation to your iris. The plan will commence at once. We're on it. Lance said that to be an a-hole, but I know why he's so peeved right now. All right, let's go get this started. Is there a point I can actually teleport to though? Well, I can teleport past it. We just gonna run there anyway, so. As well. That'd be over glorified rollerblade mix. Like, could you imagine if we had these things in real life? Actually, let me not say that. We probably are developing something like similar to this in real life. I expect great things from former Special Forces Lance. I'm sorry, Uni, but I had to jump down. I'm sorry, baby. I'll never do it again. Okay, I take that back. I probably will do it again, but that's not the point. Promise not to jump off and kill you with jumping off like a retard. I promise to not jump off any more things. We'll be arriving presently. Okay. Uni? You okay? Just feeling wistful. Maybe is gonna go to Uni. This is where we went looking for fortune clovers, isn't it? Oh yeah. You really made a big deal out of that. Did not. Just wanted to wish upon one. All the others laughed in my face. Said I'd never find one here. Everyone but you guys and Zeon. You must remember. You're not the kind of guy who makes fun of people when they're trying their hardest. You help people in need. <sighs> Listen. I know you've been through all sorts of crap, but you don't know the whole story. Oh, I'm sure. There is no such thing as a traitor who rebels without cause. 
Hopefully it's Kevis or Agnes. You've sent many of my comrades off. No. Time and time again, you saved the dead. Help survivors. Even me. I know you do not make light of people's lives. So you understand? I do. But I can never be the friend to you that I once was. You don't give a set tree, do you? I wasn't talking to you, Lance. Excuse me? Maybe we can't go back to the old days. But we can build something new. Leave your platitudes for after. The battlefield awaits. Don't worry. We'll win. No one's dying on our watch. Never again. You goddamn right. Time to move. Stay sharp. We about to do this thing. Yeah. About to go out here and whoop some butt. About to save the world. Well, you about to save the colony. Kick some ass. Then. And, and then I don't really know. I, I don't know what else at that. I'm sorry. If I didn't think that far ahead. I'll issue the order. Right. I, I did not think that far Don't ahead. I'm, I'm not gonna lie to you. I'm collecting this. I know the objective is over there. I know Golden Arrow. I know. I know. I know. Whee! There's a lot of them. Oh, some big ships. This will be a. We can use the terrain for defensive advantage. First, we need to hurt their morale. Before that. We need to talk. I'll remain here and fight for as long as I stand. That's also part of the plan. It will be a grueling fight. I won't have time to be looking out for possible deserters. Hold on. Are you telling us to find a chance to escape? I never said that. But this battle should be of little importance to you. Spark's sake, Zeon. Just how rotten do you think we are? I see where you're coming from, but we're fighting on our own terms. We owe a debt to Colony 9. Maybe it wasn't for that. But not anymore. Just shut it, you. How hard is it for you to accept someone just wants to do a good deed? Hey, get a clue. Lance is right. Lance. How often does he need telling not to abandon himself to his feelings? Have you given in? <laughs> Still, might as well strike while the iron's hot. I like how he ran off and technically lands as my freaking support. Like, man's ran off and like, bro, you do realize you're a support, right? You must get materials. Or we'll probably never see these again. You must collect all materials. I don't think there's a reason to need that here. What the spark of Ouroboros doing here? I did not sign up for this. Actually, you did. Because this is a war. Want so us to deal run with down. it. We aren't here to kill each other. Pull back now, and we won't pursue you. I'll bet you won't. Because you'll be dead. I guess we... Oh. 
Yeah, we we still fighting, I guess. Always keep your ace in reserve. That's how the game's played. Uh. Don't falter. We have Kite and the others holding the fort. Yeah. And we'll hold the line here. Whatever it takes. Look at that, it's Hetsudo. 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 You still lost. You <laughs> lost. You lost. You suck. Squad leader's been hit. Pull back. Exactly. Get out of here. Go on. Get going. Get. You following them? Bye. I told you. I don't want needless slaughter. You're soft, rookie commander. Let me tell you something. You don't win wars while keeping your hands clean. You're gonna learn that the hard way. You'll see. Technically, you can we'll... technically win a war and keep your hands clean. Don't let it get to you. I wouldn't normally, but in this instance, I'm afraid he struck a chord. I believe I said something similar to you in the past. We were sparring with training swords. You won in the end. I did, because you always held back. That's not true. <laughs> you hated the very idea of fighting. That's how it seemed to me. And back then, I thought you'd never survive with that lofty ideal. If we don't stand for something greater, strife and conflict will grow ever fiercer. We would end up fighting not for the flame clock, but for our own bloodlust. That is who we are. It was never going to be easy. Yeah. I'm still trying to figure out what's right myself, but there's something I want to change. And to do that, I have to change myself. <laughs> Kite and the others pull through, okay? It seems we've averted disaster. For now. Not quite. There's still unfinished business. Zeon, I want you to understand the things we've seen. The truth about the flame clocks. Just let us explain. After that, we'll let you have the final say. As you wish. It also saves us an awkward silence on the way back. But don't get your hopes up. That's fine. Thank you. I'll round up everyone in the square, but first, to call any nine. Hey, at least he willing to, at least he's willing to listen. Cause everybody else has been like, hey yo, hey yo, nah, fuck, fuck that, fuck that. I don't like it. You can't. I don't believe it. Get out of here. <laughs> uh -oh. At least he's willing to listen. But I am very interested. I'm gonna just teleport back. What am I doing right now? Like a, like a, like a, like a fool. Are you serious? I have to run back. BS. Okay, whatever. Um. But yeah. At least he was willing to listen, because a lot of other people would have been like, "Yeah, get out of here with that bull." I ain't trying to hear that, bro. Like, leave. Or I'm gonna kill you. But so far, I've definitely enjoyed the story. I've lost to a few bosses due to me just not leveling properly. What I mean by, like, leveling properly. I mean, like, I didn't technically, like... I wasn't, like, level grinding, per se. I was kind of, like, just playing the game on hard mode. And like leveling a bit here and there because I don't want to like take forever to like make episodes and everything like that. But I think I'm gonna start level grinding the way I'm supposed to make sure like everybody's like leveled up, got classes leveled up, and actually like play roles appropriately. Question mark, not question mark. I said question mark like a retard. No, no, question mark is right. 
Do they really grow from a head? I can tell I'm being watched. He must be very weary of me. I mean, it's the same like y'all wings that are technically y'all ears. I end this order. I don't even wait. Do they have four sets of ears? They do. They actually do. Yeah, they, they have four sets of ears. Or do they just have wings that come out of their head? Time to eat them, huh? Is there like another way? Is there another way I could get up there? Or did I have to like go up through the building? Uh, never mind. I think I just gotta go around. Cause I figure out how to do that. No, I didn't miss the damn. Am I stupid or something? Man, forget it. I'm just about to run across the water. <laughs> like, I have this. We just run across the water. It's like, oh, I don't know. I, I guess I missed it somehow. Maybe it just wasn't there to begin with. I'm, I'm just running around. Like that. Make no damn sense, like no. Guess who it is? Of course, you would be the one person not doing it. Our heroes return. And of course, the council. Good work, Theon. Where have you been? Just watching from the sidelines. And I must say, it was quite a spectacle. In what way? Bedpot. I forget. You drones have no aesthetic sense. Your droll skirmish was one thing. It almost put me to sleep. But this here... Well, I'd say the colony is due a promotion. I recall no troll skirmish. The one where these maggots surfaced. Loads of little worms plotting together with Agnes, then deserting their duty like the cowards they are. Truly disgusting. A disgrace to the colony. And that goes for the ones who croaked for nothing, too. Even calling that troll is a disservice to the worm. Croaked for nothing? I know you see us as enemies, but this, it's our friends you're talking about. Even Wamba. Back then, how dare you! Silence, maggots! Oh, stab you. Still be tired from fighting. Well, technically, shoot you. Rejoice then. You will give me great pleasure as I crush you. Okay, so we about to probably get into a boss fight. So I'm going to cut the episode over here. It's cliffhanger real quick. <laughs> I'll be back in the next episode. It's been your boy, like speaking. I'm about to get out of here. So peace.